All right, we're here at AutoZone. We're gonna head inside, see if they have a battery for George's car. What do you think, George? Are they gonna have your battery? I hope so. <laughs> That right there is what we need, boy. I don't want a BMW. I think it's this one right here. Here it is. All that sucker in, baby. Back at the Redline HQ here. By the way, uh, if you ever decide to hit a uh, four foot by four foot, eight inch deep pothole, this is what you can expect. Gonna be pulling out the old battery and we'll get that new one installed. Come in here with a 13 millimeter socket and an extension just to make it a little easier. You'll also need the 10 millimeter to loosen up the bolts on the bar holding in the battery. Now on either side of the battery here, you're gonna have to press in a little tab to pull up this plate with all the positive connections on it. Also using a flathead screwdriver, we'll need to disconnect two connectors on the junction box here. Pull this out and set it aside for now. Disconnect our positive lead from the battery. Now the last thing you have to do before you can take out the battery, loosen up the bolt for the retaining bracket down at the bottom, located right here. And now the battery is free. <clears throat> Correct battery is an H6, not an H7 or an H8. Connect our positive lead here. Now we're gonna come in here with our bracket and lock down the battery. Now once your battery is all locked in, we're gonna reconnect all of our connections, starting off with the junction box. Now we can reconnect our negative terminal. Once you have both the terminals reinstalled, be sure to tighten them back down with a 10 millimeter socket. All that's left to do is to reinstall the retaining bar. Now, before we close the trunk, we're gonna make sure the car fires up. Here we go, cross your fingers. Oh yeah! What do we got, George? Now that is something you do not wanna see. Now we're gonna plug in my Carly adapter connect it to my phone and we'll register the new battery to the car. All right guys, that concludes this video on how to replace your E90 battery. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave a like below and subscribe if you've yet to do so. Thanks guys, I'll see you next time on JD Cars.